And we're back we're here with New England Patriots. We're going to do a New England Patriots rebuild. First thing I want to do is look at free agency. You got Delaney Walker as a tight end. That, that'll be nice pickup for our offense. One year deal. And then we can sign some linebackers. Cam Awake, that'll be nice. And then say Preston Brown. Um No, we don't need Preston Brown. We don't need a right outside linebacker. Josh Uche would be good, I'm pretty sure, because that's our right outside linebacker. If I'm not mistaken. Yes, he is. And he's a rookie, so I want to get him as much playing time as possible. Get him starting, develop him. So, yeah. We signed to Lenny Walker. We signed Cameron Wade. Let's start simulating. And we lose the Lions week one of the preseason. Let's upgrade all of these players. Week two of the preseason. Let's upgrade some more players as we blow out the Panthers. Week three. We lose three Eagles, we got cut nine players. Um, let's just cut him. Him. Corey Cunningham. Justin Heron. Tosh Maloya. We gonna cut. We'll keep Brandon King, why not? Brian Hoyer, Yardney Kajuste, Jared Stidham. We'll add Gluna Olsoweski to the practice squad. And that's it. We got upgraded players. Alright, we finished week four season goal, um Let's say make the playoffs. Upgrade players. And let's simulate week one against the Dolphins. And we beat the Dolphins 37 to 31. As Isaiah Wynn and Najee Turan gets upgraded. Week two against the Seahawks. We win and we um at a um we um re sign some players. We go from a three year thirty four million dollar deal. He resigns. Joe Thune, we got off from a four year Forty nine million dollar deal. He re signed. As we scout college play, we were just gonna auto generate it. This is um quarterback Dave Snell. 
And let's do this, um, Floyd Duhon. Um, Orlando Cage. Ramon J. Gary, sure. Marco Copeland Rashad McFadden and that's all we have for um scouting. As we get an upgrade couple players, Tony Michelle. Oh no, we have two injuries. Oh wow, it's a lot of injuries. Pitchers have a lot of injuries. Um, but two two ones I'm guessing is these two. J C Jackson, Demir Boyd, I have no idea who like 'cause I have what's the name? Um pre existing injuries on. So let's send week three against the Raiders. We win. That's going to up, not upgrade, um, we sign some more players, David Andrews. We'll give him two year, $19 million deal. He resigns and Jason McCordy. I'll give him two year twenty three million dollar deal. Alright. As we upgrade to play Damir Boyd and Jake was that I couldn't um see who else it was, but yeah. As we simulate week four. A big injury decision as we lose for Chiefs. The mayor Boyd is healthy enough to play. We could play through injury. We'll start back up. We're going to start back up and Nikhil Harry. As we um, can resign some more players, let's resign JC Jackson. Just do a five year, $40 million deal. Okay, he doesn't accept it right away. James White. Let's do five year twenty six million dollar deal and he resigns. As we upgrade players, Kyle Duger. As we send week five. Resign some more players. Um, was it J.C. Jackson? Let's do five year, forty point seven million dollar deal. He resigns Cam Newton. Give him a three year, sixty eight million dollar deal. He doesn't accept right away. We're not going to resign Lawrence Kai. We get an upgrade a couple of players. Now that it's a bye week, I want to look at the trade block. Right outside linebacker. We have 72 of all Josh UJ. Nobody really good. Okay.
Let's continue swimming. Let's swim week seven against the forty niners. And this week is a trade deadline. We will make a trade as we upgrade our players. And let's re-sign Cam Newton, hopefully. Three year sixty nine million dollar deal. He doesn't accept it. Okay, trade center. I'm going after Robert Quinn. That's a good person just to go after we contending, so yeah. They need a quarterback. I'm not giving up Cam Newton, but I'll give up Matt Barkley. They are not interested at all. I'll give up Dietrich Wise Jr. Yeah, we'll give up Demetrius Wise Jr. And then like a feature first. I mean, not a feature first. No, well, I'll give up first. We're going to be good this year, so there's no need for it, really. As we get our right outside linebacker in Robert Quinn. That's a great trade for us. His Robert Quinn will now be our starting right outside linebacker. Let's look at his stats for this season. 24 tackles, 3 tackles for loss, 4 sacks. Pretty good. So yeah, let's continue swimming into the rest of the season. Yeah. We beat the Bills. Let's see if we can re-sign Cam Newton. Three years, $69.4 million. He doesn't re-sign yet. Let's see what... Robert Quinn did his last game. He only had one tackle. Kind of disappointing, but it's okay. You know, I'm curious. Demetrius Wise Jr. He was for the Bears. I don't think he played. Yeah, he didn't even play for him, so that's good. I guess. I don't really... Yeah, okay. It's fine, I guess. So let's upgrade some players. 
to kill her. As we are five and two. I'm not even gonna look at Andrews because it's hard to tell who was out in like Madden and who was out in real life, so yeah. We lose her jet. Let's see if we can re-sign Cam Newton this time. I'm just gonna keep on up and each thing by one. 69.7 million. He's going to test free agency. I forget him then. Let's upgrade Joe Thune, Adam Butler. Let's simulate against the Ravens. We won by one point. Let's upgrade some players, Isaiah Wynn, and others. We beat the Texans, and we get an award. Stephon Gilmore, seven tackles, one interception, and a touchdown, so he got a pick six, good for him. Next we get an upgrade player, Kyle Duger, Joe Juan Williams, and others. We beat the Cardinals. Get another upgrade on a couple players. Duncan Keen and Byron Coward. Same against the Chargers. We beat the Chargers. As we get another upgrade on our players, Jonathan Jones and a couple of others. As we face the Rams. And we lose the Rams as we get another upgrade on Nikhil Harry and somebody else. As we face the Dolphins. We lose the Dolphins. And we get another upgrade. Jacoby Myers and Bo Allen. As we face the Bills. We beat the Bills. As we upgrade Chase Winovich and somebody else. As we face the Jets. We make the playoffs when we face the Bills in a wild card game. And we get a weekly award. Chase Winovich, four tackles, four sacks. And we get another upgrade. Adrian Phillips, Kyle Duga, Joan Bentley, Josh Uche. Let's check out the stats for the season. 
We won 11 and 5, first in our division. Cam Newton, 4,580 yards, 27 touchdowns, 16 interceptions. James White, 838 yards, 8 touchdowns. Julian Edelman, 1,051 yards, 5 touchdowns. Delaney Walker, 965 yards, 3 touchdowns. He did great. John Bentley, 98 tackles, 13 tackles for loss, half, one and a half sack. Jason McCordy, three interceptions, 85 tackles, two tackles for loss, half a sack. Chase Winovich, eight and a half sacks, 13 tackles for loss, 41 tackles. How did Robert Quinn do? He had 58 tackles, seven tackles for loss, four sacks. One pass deflection. Let's check that out compared to his other years. This is basically his second best year. About his second best year, maybe. This is the most. First time he actually had tackles for losses, but. Oh, well, he had 19 sacks one year. Whoa. Yeah, this was... 2013 was definitely his best year by far. He didn't have any forced fumble or fumble recoveries this year, but... He did have a pass deflection, four sacks, seven tackles for loss, 58 tackles. Definitely one of his best seasons. That was a great trade. We had the third best offense in the league and the sixth best defense in the league, so that's great. Matt Ryan, MVP. Sean McVay, coach of the year. AFC Offense Play of the Year, Pat Mahomes. Defense Play of the Year, Tremaine Edmonds. Offensive Rookie of the Year, Justin Herbert. Patrick Queen. Baker Mayfield. Josh Jacobs. Jarvis Lanchy. Mitchell Schwartz. Miles Garrett. Rashawn Evans. DJ Hayden. Oh, that's stuck. Um. No, we didn't have nobody, okay? Those are the awards for the AFC. Yeah. Let's face the Bills in the wild card game. We beat the Bills in the wild card game. And if you don't know, this is a one year deal, so. I'm at one year rebuild, so yeah. Especially since Cam Newton didn't resign. Isaiah Wynn gets um upgraded and a couple others. As we face the Browns in the divisional game. We lose to the Browns thirty one to fifteen. Damn. Who would have thought? I really thought I was going to win this game. I meant win this year. Well, I guess this rebuild is a failure. We didn't really do much to the team because I thought I felt confident. All we did was um we added Delaney Walker, who had a great season. Um, what, I think he had like 900 yards, three touchdowns. Yeah, 965 yards, which was his best since... He yeah, is second best in his career. And we also added um Cam Wake. Let's see how he did. Thirty five tackles, four tackles for loss, two sacks. Three pass deflections. Um, he had a pretty good year. Not his best, but like, uh, he could have did better, but he did pretty good. And then we saw Robert Quinn's stats. Yeah, we saw Robert Quinn's stats. Oh, he was injured. Oh, damn. That sucks. Maybe that's one of the reasons we lost, but yeah. So that's it for this 
video. Um, I'll send them to the Super Bowl to show y'all who wins. And that'll be it for this video. Remember, like, subscribe, um, turn on post notifications. And the Browns and the Saints are in the Super Bowl. Right. Let's see who wins. And the Saints beat the Browns 34-10 in the Super Bowl. Okay, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.